Okay, well, I just want to show you, starting backwards actually, this is what the finished product looks like. I now have the screen on the outside, so no bugs can get in, even to the second layer, and now it's all black on the outside too. So, uh, after this clip, it's going to start from the beginning, but it's always going to show the brown outside, but when I explained in the last clip, I found it's better to have the screen the no no see him screen on the outside so the bugs can't even get into the middle of it so the lights against us now so that's the finished product so uh, coming up is the start of the video okay this is the end starting now one two three hello everybody okay so i'm gonna attempt to do something here not the best day for it in the northeast here springtime but we had 30 degrees this morning it's in maybe 40 now but very windy so between the sun coming in and the wind and traffic i just want to do this quick i'm doing the window screen uh, my window covers for my jeep um, everybody does them i'm going to do a little different twist to it though um, so i'm going to try to do this in pieces so this is one that's cut already a small one i'll show you in a second what that's for and this is going to be a second one, which I measured, and I'll show you, it's going to be easy. I marked it, and you can just follow the diamonds right up. You don't got to really mark it all the way. And I got this snipper, and I cut it through the diamonds. It's not going to be that straight. Let's go up the diamonds. And I, I marked this one a little bigger, so but let's just see how it's going to fit. Okay. You see? Yeah. Okay. So now when it's a bigger one like that, there's a space there. So the piece that I cut off from the shorter one, it's flat. I just put that in the hole. Can you see? Yeah. In the hole. Into the window and just leave that there. And the slot is taken up. But that's not really what I'm here to show you. What I'm here to show you, I'm gonna do on the other side. I think it'll come out better. I do it in two pieces also. So let me let me go to the other side. Okay, I'm on the other side. Sun's in my eyes here, but I think this picture might be better. So this one I have in the window. And it's just, just a short piece. So I have the window. The window guards. Am I getting it? Yeah. And you can't even see it. It's up on underneath. So that's really stealth. There it is there. So that's the short one. I leave that in there all the time. Leave it in all the time. Nobody can see it. Just the window guard. So now my plan is, it's a double plan, is to, I can leave that there and then put a bigger one in. I can leave the little one in there. Fit that right in, maybe. Right in. Okay. Watch my fingers. Right there. Right in. And then take that little scrap. Tricky, but once you get in, get in. In there. It's sealed all the way, and I got it big. But, okay, so maybe somebody's on that. But what I'm doing, a little different, is <clears throat> this one is the one. I, I 
Well, I'm gonna I'll insert a picture of it. Uh, can't think of the name now, but there'll be a picture of the package. It's no seam screening, which I put on with Gorilla Tape. See the tape? Oh yeah. I left the screen. I'm thinking on the big one. On the big one, I'm thinking I might take the original screen off because when I taped it, it kind of bubbled up. So I don't know. I'm I'm still debating of that. So now I got. The no seam screen on there. So for the little tiny bugs that get through the regular screens, because the regular Home Depot, it's a pretty thick screen. It'll keep flies out and probably regular mosquitoes, but the little no seam bugs, they'll get right through that. So I got the screen on there, cut it to size, and I gorilla taped it all the way around. Hope we can see it. Yeah, yeah, I think we see it. Yeah. So that's that's that. Double in up on top. Is the small the small one that stays under the the rain guard all the time and you can't even see it under there so I can keep that window open all the time and it's got the no seam screens and the regular screens and then I put the other one there and then on the inside because when the windows down a little bit you get a crack here I take that little scrap that's kind of like this like this the flat piece and I push it in, in there, and in there. And that seals the whole thing up like that. So I can have a big window flow. With the no seam on, taped on there, nobody's getting in. No critters. I'll just show you the other one on the other side. Maybe the light's a little better now. So this is the side. You cannot see it. It's in there, and the window's open. And I guess you can see it there a little bit. But it's in there and that's it so that's my little twist on it my little twist is making it the double layer and then no seam screens so uh i got my new bed in there maybe i'll just show fast peak a lot of junk on it but got a new i got a trifold mattress with a two inch underneath nice and comfy now i'm gonna sleep good i'm gonna sleep good in there okay so Say goodbye to the Jeep for now. Two more weeks, three more weeks, out on adventures again. Take it easy. I might add on to this some photos. The no see him package and some of the other things. Okay, one little update. First of all, here's the, the netting I used. Equinox, Equinox, no seam netting. There's all the info. I'm gonna post the picture behind after the video, and I'll put the link in the description. So I just want to do one update. I made one little mistake on this one. Well, it's not a mistake, but I hate bugs. I hate bugs, and I was thinking about it. I had the no seam screen on the inside, so little tiny bugs could get to the from the outside to the the, the standard screen and they're gathering there. They won't be able to get in the car, but they might be in the netting. So what I did, I redid it, and that's the outside. No, that's the inside. Wait, that's the wrong one. Hey, wait. Okay. So here, that's the outside. That's the outside, and the screening is on the outside now. I got the tape all the way around, and the inside is just the stocks. That's not no screen. Both screens are on the outside now. But the no seam is on the outer one, so they won't be able to get through. And just one last thing. The tape I use, it's like about three-quarter of an inch. It's uh, Gorilla Weatherproof Tape. So I've used this all over the car. So that's all I wanted to add was um, I found that I didn't really want... I didn't really want the... Bugs to get into the screen and maybe just you know, die in there, whatever, to be in the screen. So th the way I did it now on the outside is the no see -em. Actually, both screens are out there, but the outer one is no, no see -em. So that's what I'm going to do now. That's how I'm going to leave it. So thanks a lot for watching. And uh, I put a few pictures in at the end, including the Equinox. And I'll put it in the description. So thanks for watching.